All right, welcome back to Let's Play RE5. We just got through disposing of Irving. This is what my arsenal looks like right now. Um, I'm kind of low because of that last ambush. I burned a lot of ammo, but that's okay. Uh, this next level is actually um, kind of loaded with loot, so um, I haven't been doing any upgrading in a while. But I'm about to pick up a lot of loot here, so once I pick it up, I'll do a checkpoint reset and, you know, uh, guess I'll let her hold that shotgun for now. She's got a lot of TMP ammo. Mm, okay. Got these handgun boots for reserve. Just oh, just in case something you know comes up and I need to use it. All right, let's move this right along. I think we're on four dash one right now. I can't remember which chapter this is, but this chapter is actually loaded with um sellable stuff. So, if if I'm correct, if this is the one indeed loaded with ammo, I mean, loot. Uh, man, that fight with Irving was fun, man. <laughs> I love that fight with Irving. I love it. I love it. That name Irving said. Excelia. Flash grenade. You know what? You I'm gonna keep that handy because parasites are very annoying in this game. Tricell. Uh, let's there see. Is a connection. What does that mean for Africa? Not sure. Keep but it down there, just in case I need to use it. As quickly as possible, because those move. There's a certain parasite in this game that can kill you instantly, and it's very annoying. I hate that thing. I ran from him last time. I hate finding that. Ugh. When he kills you, he, he he like eats the top of your body. I mean, he like he like eats you when he kills you. It's very. Ugh. I hate dying like that. Uh, I think there's some spiders or something down here. Uh, yeah. But they're not too tough, fortunately. I don't know why I'm not using my knife. I mean, I mean, I know, I know why I'm not using my knife. I don't like the knife in this game. I mean, I've got plenty of handgun bullets, so you know. Yeah, I'm supposed to be dropping stuff, man. Come on. Go. Okay. Before going up the ladder, it's not, it's not too far. There's something back here you want to collect to sell. That's still you insect. I, mean, I don't think spiders are considered insects, are they? <laughs> uh, okay, let's move along. Why y'all not dropping stuff? I guess they only drop stuff when you like, really need ammo. Who knows? Okay. Uh, this isn't what I was talking about, but there's a sellable item back here. Somewhere. There's another one of those blue octagon thingies back there. Oh, shit. Off. All right, you little bastards. You're asking for it. And once again, she's doing all the work. Now, where's that damn thing? Oh, okay, I see it. I see it. I don't usually use my map, but, you know, I see it. What that? Oh, I was, I was supposed to climb. <laughs> Here it is. Uh, that's not a bad item there. It's worth, uh, like, 3000 I think. I don't know, somewhere around that. three or 4000 somewhere around there. That's where that came from. Did she kill the one up here already? Hang ammo for me. What's in here? 100. Wow, that's a lot of money. And, uh. Oh, here it is. Something in here. Come on now. Come on. Out, out with it. Thank you. Emerald to sell for a thousand, I think. More annoying. Oh, shit. Look at this. I think a flash grenade disposed of them instantly, but I'm saving it for a parasite. I'm saving it for more annoying enemies. Put it down, meatball. I see some ammo. Hang on. Damn it! It's a good thing that that the attacks don't hurt that much, because I probably would have been dead by now if it did. I don't screw with them in the professional mode. I use the Hydra to kill them in the professional mode, so I don't know how much damage they do in the pro mode. All right. More loot. And... Can I use my knife for this? Oh, I think I hit her. Yeah, I can. More loot. More loot. 
And even more loot. And that's just the beginning. We're just getting warmed up. <laughs> this place has a lot of loot. <laughs> I see, is this a checkpoint? Yeah, well, same, but same thing. Uh, but fuck it, Timmy, let me do some upgrading. Now that I picked up a few things. Let's see. It's not much, but, you know. I can use upgrade my weapon now. There we go. Oh, 2000? Uh, oh well. It'll work. All right, uh, for stars, give that to you. Uh, I don't think I'm needing this right now. Let me just save that for later. Uh, that's yours. Uh, let's see here. Uh, hmm. Nah. Shotgun. Can't do that anymore. Can't do that anymore. That no. Let me focus on her right now. Three thousand. Yeah, I do that. And your capacity, three thousand. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm mainly focusing on, on her right now. I'm, I'm all right. It's, it's, it's her since I, I love to have her go on the offensive side. I mainly focus on her weapon. She has a shotgun, but that's just in case of extreme emergency. Uh, hmm. I ain't got much left. Can I do anything with my handgun? Uh, okay, that'll work. All right. We uh ooh, I need to get a I need to get a healing item. Just in case something happens. One for me. And one for her. Oh, she already got one. Since we're about to be separated for a little while. Alright, let's continue on. My weapon's out of place. Alright. Let's go, baby. I never knew such a place existed here. Looks like there's been some recent activity. I hope Irving was telling the truth when he said we'd find answers in this place. As I said, uh, this level is completely loaded with loot, so I think this is the best level to do over and over and over again. If you like trying to get money, this is the best level to do it. Not doing regular runs, of course. I mean, you want to wait until you've got, like, infinite ammo and beating the game and stuff like that. But when you're trying to um, max out your, your regular weapons so you can unlock stronger weapons. And do this on a... Try to do this on a high difficulty so stuff like this is more valuable. I like how she moves her head up and down like that. Yes, I love that. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. Alright, uh, I think there's something else around here somewhere. Mm, there's like an emerald around here. Somewhere, and let me go back to my map because I'm lost again. So, I mean, it's it's a fun level, but but you're gonna find yourself getting lost here a couple of times your first time through. There it is. There we go. And uh, Come on. wait, damn it, don't go there yet. Let me get this first. Damn it, Sheva! I told you to wait. I guess that's automatic. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be using that very soon. I think they gave you that for a reason. <laughs> uh, I think I'm alright. Here they come! I'm trying to like blow them, blow a lot of them up at once. But they're like on the move here. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I think that's exactly why they gave you that grenade. For that little spot. And once again, she's helping me out with her rifle there. Die! Good night! Yes, yes, yes. I mean, I don't use the melee attacks a lot, but I do indeed use that. Oh, shit. Should have brought my... Should have brought my, uh... What 
What the hell? Out of my face. Where's my magnum? Okay, there it is. Can you die, please? Thank you. Jesus. Hate those things. The Parasite's Resident 4 aren't too much of a threat, but the ones in this game are extremely annoying. For stars, they run. That's the first problem. And they're a lot harder to kill. Unless you use a flash grenade, of course, but... Is there something in here? Yep, there's another one. It's only a thousand, but it still adds up. Too lazy to pull out my knife, and... I kind of want that, that hand grenade. Can I put those... Yes, I, I mean, I, I want that red, that red herb, so... Where are you, Shovel? Where are you, baby? Oh, you're waiting on me. <laughs> On my way! This is probably another place where you're gonna end up dying a lot on the professional difficulty. Ouch! Goodbye! Please die. Thank you. And he just some shotgun ammo. Lovely. Alright. Alright. Is that it? Roger. More loot. More loot. A little taste of money, but totally on, on this difficulty, the money sucks, but on a person mode, that stuff really adds up. Alright, what are we looking like? Thanks, use this. She's got plenty of TMP ammo for now. Uh, her rifle bullets are kind of low, but that's not. Mm, I'll give this to her. Thanks. Cause she mixes instantly. Uh, hang on, ammo. Yeah. Her. Mm, you know what? Give that back. Use this. Thank you. Combine it and let me heal myself up. Thanks. All right. Uh, back to the hang on. All right. Where do we go now, baby? She's still in attack mode. Alright, now this one is a trap naturally because you see the little square thing right there. But you have to go this way and uh, also when you're landing, you're going to have to, you know, do a little interactive thing to reduce damage done to you. Here we go. Alright, and we're going to pick up a lot of loot here. And I don't want to waste too much time here because I'm going to get like ambush from all four sides. So let me just kill whatever's in my way. That takes care of them. That takes care of you, I think. That takes care of you. Oh, nice shot, baby. Thank you. He's still alive. Does the first one, did he drop anything? Nope. Put it down. You're welcome. Rifle ammo, lovely. Yeah, get those bestes, baby. And they keep coming! Die! I said die! How the hell you survive a shotgun bullet? Uh, what the? Uh. Put it down! Damn it! Thank you, baby. Damn it! Alright. Yeah, you're probably gonna be down here a lot too on, on the professional mode. That's the only problem with playing this on a professional difficulty. You get a lot of money, but you die a lot too. Unless you got a rocket launcher, but. There's the another one. And I didn't get this one over here because I was too busy trying to stay alive. But they didn't do a lot of damage, as you can see. Well, not to me, anyway. She lost by half a health, but she was getting caught by those spears, and she'd be all right. Let's see. Uh, hmm. Might as well, because I can't do a tuna for a while. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, put a handgun ammo. That's good. She got put a TMP ammo, and... Oh, here you go. All right. Did I get that? Yeah, I got that. I got that one. And let's continue on. Come on, Roger. Slow down, baby. I don't want you chicken those guys just yet. 
Here they come. Yes. Yes. Ow, no, that didn't feel very good. Who did that? You. All right. And I'm out of sniper ammo, but that's okay. There's more where that came from. Oh, I got to jump. What we got? What we got? Magnum ammo, lovely. Shotgun shells, even lovelier. Rifle ammo, all right. Uh, but I don't need it at this point. I'll give it to her in a minute. Thanks for the help. Here you go. I owe you one. All right. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Okay. Now this is kind of annoying. You have to like run to that gate before it closes, but there's a little catch to it. There's gonna be like lots of barrels coming down. You wanna. Oh shit. Now I see some loot up there. I'll worry about getting it later. As I get through here. Okay. Can I go back? I didn't know you can move. Shotgun ammo, nice. Let's see. I'm only gonna pick up like the shotgun, uh TNP or something like that if there's any. I think all this stuff is like little money. Well she's picking up the handgun bullets anyway, so. Matter of fact, go. Go. let's go pick up everything. Pick it up. Pick it up. <gasps> Shotgun, nice. I told you I'm too lazy to pull out my knife. That's why I'm using my handgun. I'm too lazy to do this and do that. I don't like doing that. It's very boring. Pick it up, babe. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. What we got? Handgun bullets. Uh, give me. I need ammo. Roger. Use this. Much appreciated. Uh. I guess pick up a hundred here and there. I guess it does kind of add up, but still, man. The money drops in this game are kind of lame. All right. We're good. Now, I think I saw something up here glowing. Uh, I think I saw something up here. Can't remember. Mm. Is that a box? No. I could have swore I saw something glowing up here when I was running. Oh yeah, that's one of those um, one of those uh, octagon things again. Uh, it's uh, it's right there. Yeah, you see it? I don't need to shoot it because I already did in my other files. So I'm not gonna worry about it right now. But I know I saw something. <laughs> All right, let's move this along. And here comes a uh, a very annoying uh, cutscene, which is kind of difficult in the professional mode, of course, because you know you can't miss your commands. Uh. I think it's a little run sequence where you gotta jump like three times or something and you gotta grab at the end. Yeah, definitely. Oh boy, I hate this. And here we go. Let's go! Run, 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 jump! I mean, this is not too difficult, but you know. I think this is harder in the pro mode. I think you gotta press it more times than you do in the normal mode. <laughs> I'm not sure. Run, 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 jump. And I think I gotta grab in a minute. Oh, yeah, right there. There we go. See, you'll probably keep running if you're doing, if, if you if you're like doing that in pro mode by accident and you're gonna fall. <laughs> all right, we got all that mess. And this thing is closing in on 20 minutes, so we're going to cut it right here. I'm going to go to my checkpoint, and I'm going to reset it and upgrade my weapon, so stay tuned for part two. All right, and it's time for yet again another shovel run of the level I was just on. Uh, let's see here. Uh, hmm. This is the professional anyway, for those of you just joining. This is, when I do Sheva, I do the professional. Because I told you I wanted to do both of them. Now, this is kind of hard because um, there's a certain point where both you and Sheva will be separated. And while you're separated, the enemies are going to be ambushing you. And if your partner gets hit, then she or he is pretty much screwed up because there's no way you're going to get to him in time to heal him. So 
you want to try to trigger that fight and then quickly rejoin each other so y'all can heal each other once um you know y'all get hit because Chris is I mean your partner's gonna get hit for sure if they're by themselves it's possible but I don't have any proof try so if there is a connection what does that mean for Africa not sure but if we keep going we're bound to find out these little things are very annoying I'm just glad they don't take hits too well they take them slightly better on on this difficulty but there's still nothing to worry about if you got uber weapons Die, you little scumbags. Did Chris kill that one? I don't know. Come on, he's in attack mode. I was wondering why he just left me like that. Let's go. Let's not waste time here. Do I have a flash grenade? No, cause I'm, about, I'm about to fight about 20 of them. Well, maybe not that many, but... This is a lot of them. No need to pick up the loot. There's loot here, but let's not pick it up. Let's just move along. All right, and this is where it gets tough. This is another level that I simply I cannot stand on the professional difficulty. Looks like there's been some there's quite a few ambushes that. here. I hope Irving was telling the truth when he said we'd find answers in this place. But as I said earlier, one of the ambushes happens while you and Sheva are unfortunately separated. And oh shit! I forgot. Is Chris going to run ahead or is... I don't know how it is. I mean, I, I don't know exactly how it is when um when you control uh, Sheva. But if Chris is by himself, he's going to die for sure. Let me see. Is it... Is he gonna run? Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. That's different. The ambush is gonna happen around me, so I just have to make sure I defend myself good, which isn't gonna be easy. I gotta kill these guys like quick. I died here a couple of times, my first time on this difficulty. What the hell? Isn't there someone behind me too? Uh, no. I'm gonna stay in this go. Oh! I thought I was dead there. I will be if I don't kill these guys quickly. Where's oh, Chris up there? Okay. Might need that. I mean, I got the hand cannon with me just in case. But no, for the most part, I don't need it. But I do use it in boss fights sometimes when I when I don't feel like using a rocket launcher for some reason. What the hell? Oh shit! He's back up. Wrong gun. There we go. What the? Thanks, Chris. Thanks, partner. I know that dude's behind me. Where'd he come from? Now there's some more here. I think one of them's gonna try to jump on me. I killed him before he had a chance. Shoot him while he's down, baby. What I'm talking about. Don't even get that bastard a chance to get up. Thanks, Chris. Come on. Okay. Let's continue on. Hmm. First time I didn't die there. I usually die there. Uh, is it this way? Yeah, here's the trap. Where you at, Chris? Alright. And here's another ambush, unfortunately. Checkpoint. Okay, good. I need that. Die. Die. Okay, take care of them. Back off. Kill them. Good. Where that came from, buddy? I think. Die. Die. Here he comes. I see him. Die. 
Did Chris just dodge that? Cool. You can have it. Wish I could dodge that good. Die. 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 I think that's all of them. No. Die. Thank you. As I said, uh, this is the level that you want to do over and over again when you're trying to get a lot of money to upgrade your weapons and so on. Because this level is completely loaded with loot. I recommend the professional mode once you get used to it. Because, you know, you can kill enemies and pick up their money. And that adds up too. But it'll be hard. So wait until you actually get Ubu weapons. So you can kill them quickly. Alright. Uh, let's get the rifle ready. I mean, trust me, this this is not as easy as I'm making it look. I've, I mean, I, I've died quite a few times here. Not on, not, not on this level, but levels before this, I've died quite a lot. Don't run! Don't run! Die! Thank you. Okay. And, uh, you see that up there? Whee! Okay. There we go. Remember shooting all 30 of those and beat the game unlocks this hot costume I'm using right now for Sheva. That's how you get this costume. You have to beat the game and shoot all 30 of those things. Kind of time consuming, but you know. And Shiver runs faster than Chris, so this shouldn't be too hard, but I can't get hit by those things, otherwise, I'm dead for sure. My first time through, I died here quite a good number of times. I know that, Chris. Can't hurry, I don't want to get hit. Whoa! Now that was too damn close. Does everything have to be a close call? That was close, alright. Alright. Let's go, Chris. Now remember these cutscenes where you have to press the button to dodge and so on and so forth. You have you have to do it 100 percent correct because if you miss it results in a failure, which is very unfortunate. And here's one right now. Let's start running. Here we go. Run, jump. Run. Jump. Oh, shit. See? I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button. In the easy mode, it was uh, it was uh, it was the jump was always the 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 square button. This time it's random. That's nothing that's hard about this. It's more random in this difficulty than it is in the regular difficulty. You don't know which button's gonna be. See, this time it was square. Last time it was circle. See what I'm talking about? You have to pay attention. Square. All right. Whoop. There we go. Very sneaky little bastards. 